Hello Capricorn, how you doing? Welcome to your July reading for the first half of the month. Without further ado, let's get straight into it. All the information is below so you don't need me to repeat it. So what is July in store for my caps? July for Capricorn, please guides. First card, Queen of Wands. Fire energy, friendly. Oh, that was quick to come out. Ace of Cups, as I was saying, fire energy, very friendly, very loving. Likes to do rather than to talk. Can be a little bit selfish and do things for their own ends. See the black cat at the bottom? This energy can carry hidden motives. Whatever this situation is, there's love involved. Something's possibly coming full circle. The world can also represent travel. Long distance. Not from afar. Not necessarily in your own country. These energies can work vice versa. Maybe Capricorn, you've developed a love for somebody overseas. Temperance. Balance. Wow. Just this. Another balance card. See the scales? Two major arcana, three major arcana cards here. I'm getting somebody from afar, Capricorn, wants to balance the situation out. Four of Cups. Somebody's been reevaluating, or somebody in the past has rejected an offer. And the second card that came out, eight of wands. Communication, sudden burst of energy. Told you, this energy is an actioner. That can be your energy also, Capricorn, at this moment. We, carry, we all carry the traits of all the signs within us, so this is why I don't mention you could, you could be dealing with this sign or that sign. Change of direction. Beneficial changes. It looks like good times lie ahead for you, Capricorn. Maybe somebody thinks you're their world. Maybe you've been apart for a while. And there's an opportunity for another chance to get together. See where this goes. I'll pull a few more cards. The moon. Yes, there's things going on behind the scenes. 
that you don't know about. Maybe somebody's planning a trip and want to surprise you. Could be that this love that's grown, or this realization, aces always represent new beginnings to me. It could be a realization. Somebody's deep love for you. Yes, there's certainly changes coming into the situation. Another major arcana. This is a very strong reading, Capricorn. The Wheel of Fortune also means divine timing is at hand. So when the time's right, somebody's going to reveal something to you. Yeah, the Emperor. That's on top of justice. Usually the Emperor is a kind of energy that has to make decisions based on logic rather than with the emotions. Maybe Justice is stepping in and saying you need to take the lead role in this situation. And two cards popped out, King of Pentacles, Nine of Cups. That's telling me that somebody very practical, very grounded, this and this person is the same, usually plays the leadership role. I suddenly realised they've got feelings they didn't know they had before. Whatever this situation is, I'm feeling more and more that they're going to come and see you. Yeah. Somebody has regrets. there was an opportunity arose before when they didn't take it now they're regretting it it can mean that you two separated and now somebody's realizing that they have a lot of love for you and they're regretting losing you parting from you queen of swords Yes, you're going to get the truth when the time's right. And also, somebody's feeling the pinch of separation. That's what this is telling me. possibly in another country they obviously think you're their world or possibly even some tarot readers even see this as a soulmate card so there's very strong feelings here but they've not been revealed to you somebody is holding their feelings in and trying to see it logically And as I said that, Queen of Cups. And I feel somebody definitely
definitely wants to come in and tell you the truth. Maybe these feelings have been holding, being held back for a long, long while. And again, Ten of Pentacles, stability. Ten of Pentacles is basically you've got it all. You see how the family's in there, look. Grandparents, children, parents, two dogs. Somebody wants it all with you, Cap, or you want it all with them. Yeah, it's <laughs> somebody from the past. This card's been popping up a lot lately. There's obviously a lot of universal energy flying about. And it can mean thoughts of the past. Somebody's thinking how good it was in the past and now they have regrets. And they're going to come in. You have two travel cards here. This is telling me distance. But it looks like there's going to be a sudden surge of activity. And your past is going to come round again. Whatever happened in the past is going to come full circle. You're going to have another chance to do it right. As with all free will there, Capricorn, the choice is yours or theirs. I wish you a great July. Bye for now.